Hey everybody, it's Nikki. You're watching my channel. And today I would like to uh, show you my what I carry in my fire kit. And don't mind the arrows flying through the air. It's just my oldest showing off. And I guess I'll have to do a lot of editing today because, yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right, let's get to it. All right, this is my fire kit. This is what I like to carry when I come outside and make a fire. And you guys are crooked. How can I do that to you? All right, that's better. So, like I said, this is my fire kit. This is a horrible day trying to do a video. I'm going to have to do a lot of editing now. I might do a little clip, you know of bloopers at the end of it so stay tuned all right so what I like to do is keep a flashlight on on the bag just in case you never know when you might need it so I have been here um, to start with a little candle that I put together and I seal it up to make it waterproof with a little bit of uh, electrical tape And it looks just like this. Yep. Pretty cool. All right. So then I have a big lighter with some electrical tape wrapped around it. I always like to do that. You never know when you might need a you know a piece of tape to make a fire extender or whatnot. On here on this little uh, clip I like to clip my um, ferro rod and no this is not a Nathan 4071. Will it do? Yes. Is it good enough? It does the job, but it's not it's not Nathan, so there you go. And it, you know, just in case you need it. I like a bellows. And I think you can get these on the Amazon two for four dollars now. They used to be like outrageous. Here's my speedy sharp. It does a sharpening and it does also a awesome striker. All right, in here I have my Victoria Knox as well. It's the uh, farmer. It's the one that has the two blades, the can opener, the bottle opener, and the wine cork opener with the uh, awl in the back. But it's nice. It clips on very nicely. I have some uh, inner tube Ranger Vans. They're fire extender. Uh, you can use them to keep things from getting wet waterproofer uh, endless supplies endless uses sorry I have two trick candles in here very useful got a sharpie never go anywhere without a sharpie because you the minute you do you'll need one I've got some jute twine make it into a bird's nest light cordage whatever you might need it for. And here is my um, cotton balls with uh, Vaseline. I always carry these just in case. You never know. And of course you have to have some fat wood. And this is a lot of fat wood. It only takes a little bit to make a... It goes a long ways. And these are my um, homemade sure strips that I made. I don't know if you've seen it. I made a uh, video on how to do it. If you're interested, it's on my channel. This is just a piece of leather. So therefore, if I want to scratch some fat wood off, there it is. And it's dry. So it would be a dry ground for me to put my shavings on. I think that's uh, a cotton ball. 
bag that was left over. I didn't even know that was in there. Here's a, uh, a Duraflame fire starter. All right, we have some wind issues. Sorry about that. Now in here is my uh, little baby flint and steel, is what I like to call it. It does the trick. I really like it. I have bigger ones in the house. Maybe you see the video, saw the video from yesterday. But this is fits right into this fire kit and it serves its purpose. And here's some char cloth that I made over the weekend. Again, I made a video on it if you'd like to go back through. And then I also put a uh, oxygen absorber in there to keep it from getting moist or damp or whatever. And I like to take advantage of the uh, Altoy tin, the ba the little tins. They make handy little um, carriers. <laughs> and I have a uh, magnifying glass, renewable source of fire. You know, you never know when you might need fire, so there you go. Then this is just a uh, sec uh, one of those um, cutters. Yes, it has a saw and a knife, screwdriver, a bottle opener. It's useful. And I think, yep, this, another one. One is one is none, two is one. So I have an extra blighter in, in the uh, bottom of the pouch. And that's it. That is it in my pouch. This door is vibrating. Alright, so that was my fire kit. If you liked it, please hit the like button, share, subscribe. And I really appreciate all you guys coming out and watching. It really does um, does me good to see all the likes and the uh, comments in the, in the below section. Alright, y'all be safe. Y'all be safe. <laughs> Take care and God bless.